I've been studying mosquitoes since 2010, and what's really interesting to me is all the products available, uh, commercially available products. And you go to a store and you see these uh, uh, quick buys or uh, right next to the registers and stuff like that, and there's a ton of bracelets and repellent devices that are, you know, oh, a quick buy. And so what I was wondering was what kind of products actually are effective and what kind of product, like how many of these products are just, you know, an impulse buy and you're throwing your money away, you know? So I think there's a really big question as to the efficacy of the products that are available commercially and since I've been working with mosquitoes for so long, it was a question that uh, I decided to explore. I selected these products based on their active ingredients and we tested these products in a wind tunnel using a taxis cage. We actually developed a new method for testing um, mosquito repellents. This method is highly repeatable, very accurate, and very effective. We tested these products over a six month period, really. We had to acquire all the products and there was a selection process. We basically selected the products based on active ingredients and we wanted to compare wearable devices to spray on repellents to see which one was more uh, effective. And we did see that the spray on repellent, some spray on repellents were more effective than some of the wearable devices that we tested. The active ingredients that were really successful at repelling Aedes aegypti mosquitoes were uh, DEET repellent and a Cutter Lemon Eucalyptus, a repellent with the active ingredient PMD or p 38 diol in it, otherwise known as oil of lemon eucalyptus. I think that overall what we found out was that the brands aren't as important as the active ingredients to consumers. The active ingredients are super important when considering buying a product because these are the ingredients that are protecting you from mosquitoes. I just wanted to note that you know not all mosquito repellents are considered equal. There are some that are, are sitting at the front of the store for you to select as an impulse buy and it's really important for you to look at those active ingredients and make sure that you're not wasting your money. Eye on Research is a production of New Mexico State University.